The NFL has all different types of rules. You can't have stickers on your helmet. You have to have your uniforms tucked in. What the president is saying, and I think the owners should meet and they should vote on a rule. This is about respect for our military. This is about respect for our first responders. This is not about Republicans or Democrats. Players have the right for free speech off the field. On the field, this is about respect for lots of people. And I don't understand why there's rules that when the Dallas Cowboys wanted to put stickers on their helmets out of respect for people there, they couldn't do it. But now the NFL is saying people should be able to decide what they want to do and disrespect the United States flag. Well, to, to, pre to, to play devil's advocate here, first of all, these players don't think they're disrespecting the United States flag. They think that they are engaging in peaceful protest of what they see as uh, racial oppression and inequities. And as you know, Roger Goodell, the head of the NFL, and all a whole host of um, team owners, including Robert Kraft, who is a friend of President Trump, uh, have issued statements supporting their players' right to do this uh, and criticizing the president's comments, including Robert Kraft specifically criticizing the president's tone. Why is this a fight that the president wants to have? I don't think it's a question of a fight that the president wants to have. He thinks this is about respect for the military and so many people who put their lives at risk and what the country stands for. And the owners should meet and they should decide on this rule the way they decide on any other rule. Uh, again, you know, for as long as I can remember, people have stood in honor of the country. This isn't about politics. If people want to talk politics off the field when they're not working for the NFL, they have the absolute right to do that.